In this video, we're going to demonstrate how you would prepare an offer using web forms if you were the buyer. For the purposes of this transaction, we're going to use this MLS listing, 41 Simmons Boulevard with this MLS number. First thing we do is we hit create transaction. And for here, we type in the address of the property, which is 41 Simmons Boulevard. We can just copy and paste that. For the template, if you want all the forms that are necessary ready for you, I would hit the listing selling side because we're representing the buyer. So just hit that. Import data. If we do this, it makes the offer preparation much easier because the names, the legal description will all be present there and we don't have to type it in. And for the purposes of this transaction, it is a freehold property. And the MLS number, we just copy and paste it. And hit create. And as you can see, if you input the MLS number and the address, everything here comes up automatically and uh, it saves us a lot of time preparing this offer. So for this one, I would just hit next. For step two, I would just hit next. You may fill out the irrevocable date, additional deposit. And if you do this, it will automatically come up in the form. But for this, we can just leave it blank and do it manually later on. Contact number three, step three, hit. And as you can see, this is the critical part. If you see at the forms, everything here that you need is already ready for you. And this is the forms that we have to submit for the office. The offer summary form, APS, confirmation of cooperation, by representation, working with realtor, FinTrack, receipt of funds record, and finally the trade records sheet. So I would just hit next. And once you've done this, you can now go on and, and uh, prepare your offer. And uh, this video just demonstrates how you would prepare an offer document using web forms. And thanks for watching. If you have any more questions, feel free to reach out to remaxrealty one Training.com. See you at the next video.